It's me, Sonia. So today started with me and my friend Max arguing about what's more dangerous, bears or sharks. It's bears, obviously. Mm. Ah, stop it! I needed to chill. So I went to see Maya in Toastville, because she always agrees with me. Toastville time for Sonia. Huh. Huh. Weird. I told Maya that I was coming over. Now Nick's not home either. Buffy! Is Maya here with you? Buffy! Huh? Oh! Hey, there you are, Maya. Got a super important question. For you. What's more dangerous? Oh. oh, Muffy, what's the matter? Nick, he's so so. Muffy and Nick had a huge argument. What was the argument about? Hey, hey, hey! Was it the bears? Uh, no, he was shouting about pranks and goofing off as he laughed. I do take stuff seriously and I'll prove it. I'll work for the Wildlife Refuge. Is that serious enough for you? Hmm. Wildlife Refuge? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, it's a totally amazing place. It's in the Forest of Shadows and new animal and plant species appear there all the time. They even have a chief zoologist to catalog them and everything. Hmm. Sounds like it's full of dangerous animals too. Muffy, if we go to the wildlife refuge, I'm sure you and Nick will make up and be friends again. Never. Nope. Come on, Muffy. If you do, I'll give you some of this candy. Ugh. Okay. Then we'll go by ourselves. Muffy, it's Nick. I found something incredible. You gotta see it. Uh-uh. It's probably just another prank. No pranks this time. Promise. Oh? It's so cool. Wait, what was that? <gasps> ah! Is that for real or a joke? Uh, uh, it's real. It's very real. Oh. Ah! Ah! Whoa. Sounds like Nick needs our help. Yes. Wildlife Refuge, here we come. Ooh, it's so awesome here. Think there's really dangerous animals around here? Ooh, like more dangerous than a bear? Bear? What's a bear? Guys, aren't we supposed to be saving Nick? Okay, so where do we start? The chief zoologist's office, over there. Hey, wait. Nick's probably booby-trapped with loads and loads and loads of pranks. Come on, Muffy. He wouldn't do that to us. Not here. <laughs> Hello, can I help you? What'd I tell you, Muffy? None of Nick's pranks are in here. Oh, goodness, Nick? Pranks? Oh, no. Why, he's the employee of the month. And it's only his first day, you know? Nick? Is that our Nick? Something's not right. Really, it's true. Why, he even discovered the rare and elusive variegated Shibara out there in the woods. Nick is out there filming it right now. Oh, no. The Shibara must have snatched him. Yet I have to see it. Think it's more dangerous than a bear is? Huh? Uh, what's a bear? Oh, uh... But the Chibara is indeed very dangerous. Uh, can I send you a photo? Send it to me. There you go. This is the only picture ever taken. Mm. When frightened, it sprays a strange green substance. Phew! Like skunks in my world. Nick might get a little stinky, but I think he'll be okay. Oh, it's much worse than that. The green substance turns you into a plant. <gasps> oh, no! We've got to save Nick before he's turned into a... a... a zucchini! Wait! There's so much more! Nick! 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 Hello! Uh, that's a Tostillion Mike's guarantee. Uh, Maya, is that Nick's cat? Oh. oh, I'm so sorry. That's not, uh, but this sure is. Oh no, the Chibara spray turned him into a, a fig plant. Nick, can you hear me? Buffy, quiet. You'll scare the Chibara and turn us all into plants. Look, it's already turned Nick into one. <gasps> is that? 
Oh, maybe. Nick? Hello? Can't leave him here. I'm sorry. Our argument was dumb. And I... I actually liked some of your pranks. Seriously? Yes, seriously. Oh, poor Nick. Everything's cool. We'll figure out how to turn Nick back into his old self. Trust me. <laughs> oh, is it the t t t Tabara? Quiet, don't move. Maybe it won't notice us. Hello? It's the Chief Zoologist. I didn't get a chance to tell you, uh, Duris or someone from a plant state. Uh, either scare the Chibara again to spray more green substance. Uh, That's it! We scare it! We? No, I'll do it. <laughs> hey, Chibara! Turn Nick back into himself right now, or else. Uh... <laughs> hey there! Nick? You're okay! I don't understand. So, uh, who's the fig? <laughs> No one! It was a prank! <laughs> just look at your faces! Are you serious, Nick? I knew it was just a setup. Whoa! You guys would have never seen how seriously I took this job if I didn't trick you into coming here. And I did discover the Chibara, just ask the chief zoologist. Whatever! You still owe me an apology. Ha! No, you just admitted that you love my pranks. I heard it. That's only because I felt sorry for you being a fig plant. And for the record, I wish you actually were one. <gasps> hey, guys, we need to go before the Chibara actually shows up and turns us all into tomatoes. Oh, wow. who's that? Such a little cutie. Want a candy? Oh, Adorbs! Girls, oh, be right careful! Ah. That's the... Ah. 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 the... the... That's the Jabara! Ah. And you just scared it! Chief Zoologist said, a spray of gross green stuff should turn the cactus back into Muffy. So we have to scare it some more? Yep. Uh, I wish we didn't have to, but... Hey! <sighs> oh, it's not scared of us now. Must be used to us. Come on, little guy! <sighs> oh, oh, just spray some more of that green stuff out and I'll give you the last candy! Now what? No Chibara, no candy. <laughs> Why'd I go and pull one more prank? I always take things too far. What if Muffy's gonna be a cactus forever now? Or worse, what if he withers away? Who's there? Ah, huh? some animal expert. Your info on the Chibara's wrong. You cannot scare one a second time. <laughs> Clearly you didn't hear the rest of my message. Or just take care of the plant for several days, as if it were your own family or close friend, to make them toasty and again. Looking good, Muffy. Look, you're blooming now. Get well soon, Muffy. Owie. I'm sorry, Muffy. I was wrong. When you're back to your old self, I promise I'll stop bugging you with my jokes and pranks. My work here is done. Bye, Toastians! See, See ya, Sonia. Sonia! Home time for Sonia! <laughs> if your friends ever get as prickly as a cactus, just offer them a little more warmth. So that's the story. After all that, I texted Max to say sorry for arguing. And to my girl, Sunita, in Mumbai, nothing makes me happier than a new happy stone song. See you, I'm out, bye bye
Hey, world! It's your girl, Sonia. There's so much I don't know about Toastville because I just discovered it. Like, I recently learned today is BH Day, which is some kind of holiday. So what better way to celebrate than baking my first cake ever? Little did I know that some holidays can become total nightmares. Toastville time for Sonia. Turn the magnet just so. Jam on toast. Mmm, delicious. Off we go! Seriously, is it like blissfully happy day or big hero day? And why is everyone hiding? Toastians, alert! It's BH Day. Repeat, Black Hole Day is here. Probability is high that the terrifying events of two years ago will repeat at 3 p.m. Please stay indoors. If you are caught outside at that time, remain completely silent. Don't make the same mistake as Madame Calculus. Good day and good luck! Hey there, Maya! Sonia, RJ, you toast made it just in time! Sonia! What's up? Muffy, Bebo, hi there! <laughs> Has it started already? <sighs> it's only Nick! <laughs> Yo, gang, you're all here! We always come to Maya's. To get through BH Day! Right? And to celebrate my first, uh, big heart day in Toastville, I baked a cake! BH Day isn't a party, it's a ta <laughs> Ish, what is that, like, slug surprise? Can't you see any more, Nick? Joker's gonna joke, Maya, but us bakers, we bake cakes. So, enjoy my stunning orange, blue, gluten, dairy, raisin-free, organic super cake with anchovies and peanut butter! Uh, it looks like a whale sneezed it out. What's that gooey stuff? Probably whale snot. Nick! Oh, it does kind of feel like <laughs> it. Ew. Maya touch whale snot. Ha ha. No, it's banana cream. It's okay, Sonia. It's your first try at cake making. It's not rocket science, but they do test with dogs first. There's no dog here. No problem. This is Toastville. <laughs> Betty's got major fleas. You've got fleas. He's awesome and brand new. Give him some cake. Here, popcorn. Eat it up, doggy. And blast off. Please help yourself. Would be even better. Cake brain. Oh. Toastians, it's black hole time. Be completely quiet. Is it three already? Where's Sonia and popcorn? Popcorn! Here, popcorn! <laughs> We've got to find her quickly. And be black hole food? The black hole might not show. It hasn't since it swallowed Madame Calculus two years ago. So, so are you gonna be okay then? We just can't take that chance. Let's find her! Sonia! Popcorn! <laughs> hey, what is that? Toasty 
Dragons are actually very responsive and pretty helpful in a crisis. Where is she? Wait, I hear something! How is time? No, home for... Come on! What was the password? Hey, Black Hole! More like Donut Hole! Nick, get Sonya out of here! Sonya, quick! Uh -oh. Munch Monster, I hope you get hiccups! Hiccups? <laughs> what? No anchovies! Found the grater! But where's Maya and Popcorn? The black hole swallowed them up! <sighs> so I need to bake another stunning orange, blue, gluten, dairy, raisin free organic super cake with anchovies and peanut butter! I'm Super Cook Sonia! What's better, get food poisoning or be black hole food? <sighs> what I found and improvise. Oh, oh really good. Yeah. Totally, it's way better. This won't make the black hole hiccup. Total fail. Wait, you baked a new cake to make the black hole get sick? Um, would a piece of the old cake help? Muffy! You didn't eat my cake? Sorry, couldn't risk it. Maya, popcorn. My photo didn't post. What, no bars in here? Anchovies and peanut butter has saved the day! As mayor of Toastville, I'm proud to make you an honorary citizen, which allows you to attend all classes at Toastville Elementary. Yay!
not believe what I learned about Toastville this week. It all started yesterday when I got home late because of... Detention? Sonia? Honey, how did that happen? Mom, it wasn't my fault. I was thinking about Toastville while doodling when Anastasia said they were mean pictures of our teacher and Mrs. Blantley believed her. Oh, these are cute. And they don't look anything like Mrs. Blandley. <laughs> okay, then. Um, so is it okay to go to Toastville? There's, like, a jelly jumper contest. Don't know what it is, but it sounds awesome. That'll be fun, I guess. Okay, then. Go and see your imaginary friends. But no more Toastville doodles at school. Toastville time for Sonia. When I got into Toastville, it was literally falling apart. Ah! Sonia, you okay? Hiya, Maya. So, uh, what's going on here? Attention, oh. Toastians. Be on the lookout for the notorious criminal Tooler. He's taking stuff apart all over Toastville. That's gotta take, like, forever. Why hasn't he been caught in the act yet? He does it secretly, leaving one part loose. So the stuff falls apart randomly, and by that point, Tootler's gone, just like that! And it's been going on for days. <laughs> yeah, I bet he's a crumble who's stuck in from the burnt lands on the underside of Toastland. Ah, uh, I've always said that cheese membrane is not a reliable defense against crumbles. <laughs> right, since it's made of Swiss cheese full of holes. <laughs> I don't think Tooler is a crumble. Rumor is he looks like a normal Toastian. <laughs> he looks like a multi-tool with lots of functions. You have to tell me everything. Oh, on the bus to the Jelly Jumper contest so we're not late! <laughs> Look, is that Tooler? <laughs> ah, he's like the ultimate prankster! I gotta get his autograph! <laughs> A giant donut falling off a billboard and rolling towards us? Yes, just like that, Muffy. I'm not asking you. I'm telling you. Look up. Ah! <laughs> Dad's asked me to run to the bakery for donuts, but I've never had to run from donuts. <sighs> never too late to try something new. Just in time for the Jelly Jumper contest. Attention, Toastians. Due to Tooler's crime spree, the Jelly Jumper contest is canceled. Oh, no. Hey, if we catch Tooler, will you cancel the canceling? Sure, we'll cancel the canceling. But how do you expect to when Toastville's entire police force are exhausted from <gasps> trying to catch him? Oh. Come on, guys. We'll catch Tooler, no problem. Uh, how do you propose we do that? Easy. Since he can't resist dismantling things, we'll just tempt him with something he can't resist. Ta-da! The Toastville horse in all its cardboard glory. It looks awesome! But do you think he'll buy it? Oh, yeah. Follow me. <laughs> hey, Toastians! Check out this totally indestructible statue. No one could possibly dismantle it. No way Tooler can resist this. Hey, Toastians, check out this statue that uh, no one can dismantle. 
No sign of Tuller? Maybe he found something better to dismantle? Like our beloved toothpick and olive statue? Like, no way! The toothpick and olive is under police surveillance 24-7! Not today. Why are you so scared? It's just a big olive on a toothpick! You don't understand! That toothpick holds the two sides of Toastland together! Uh, hey, Tuller, get down! Uh, 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 down. Uh, What's all the yelling uh, about? I'm right here! If you're Tuller, then who is he? <laughs> Wouldn't I like to know? I just got back from vacation. <laughs> Guess I don't need this anymore. Look. I told you it was a crumble. What are you doing? What no crumble has ever done before. Splitting Toastland in half so our burnt lands can take its rightful place on top. Crumbles are tired of living in the shadow of Toastians, so I am going to flip the burnt lands to the top of the planet. So why'd you disguise yourself as Tuller and dismantle all that stuff? So the police would go looking for him and leave the olive and toothpick unguarded. Plus he has tools for hands. He's the perfect dismantler! <laughs> a, that's really, really mean. And two, if you unscrew the olive, the planet will split in half and both sides will drift apart into space! Ah, uh, seriously? I didn't actually think of that! Ah! <gasps> <gasps> we got out just in time! Uh, guys, where is popcorn? sides back together. Hmm. Would a giant donut work? Save goodbyes for later. Tuller's going to save everyone and fix my reputation in the process. I'll carve the threads. <laughs> done and done. beside the point. Come on! Okay, now I really gotta go. <laughs> The Jelly Jumper contest is in full swing, and the competition is fierce. Who's gonna be the winner? Very exciting, not. Don't tell me we saved the world so that Nick could have a nap. Uh, of course, this is the most boring sport in Toastville, didn't you know? You could have told me. Uh, you know what, I should probably go. Home time for Sonia. <laughs> Blame on someone else makes you doubly guilty. Yeah, I'm
Unfortunately, I can't take photos in Toastville because phones don't work there. So I'll stick to doodles. Oh, a message from Anastasia. She still doesn't believe in Toastville. But now you see that the doodles aren't of our teacher, don't you? Then tell her that at school tomorrow. And to Enrique from Mexico, sadly, I can't download the Happy Stones music videos either. See you. I'm out. Bye-bye.